The purpose of this section is to familiarize you with compound machines. A compound machine is a machine that is a combination of two or more simple machines. An excavator is an example of a compound machine. On the bucket, we have wedges, the arm of the machine is a lever, and on some small excavators, you might have wheels and axles instead of a track. Some other examples of compound machines in history were a stone axe, which is a combination of a wedge and a lever, shears, which are a combination of wedges and levers, and wheelbarrows, which have levers as handles and a wheel and axle. Today, compound machines look a little different. For example, a pencil sharpener, typewriter, lawnmower, hand drill, or bulldozer can all be thought of as compound machines because they are each made up of several simple machines. Compound machines multiply the mechanical advantage of each simple machine. In order to find the total mechanical advantage, you have to multiply each of the individual mechanical advantages of all of the simple machines together. So you have to make sure you find the mechanical advantage of each simple machine in your compound machine, making sure you don't overlook any of the simple machines. Then you multiply all of these mechanical advantages together. We have seen this exact same slide several times now. Remember, the load force is equal to the effort force multiplied by the mechanical advantage. In the case of compound machines, the mechanical advantage will be the total mechanical advantage. In the next video, we will look at an example calculating the total mechanical advantage of a compound machine.